Hello everyone and welcome back to Slime Rancher and we are here with our wonderful Phosphor Rock Largo Slimes and they're doing very well and we've been gathering up, oh my gosh, so many of their little plorts. I have gathered so many plorts from them. You don't see any right now because I have been cashing them in. Look at how much money we have, you guys. 826 little coins. I'm still not sure what you call that denomination, but we have so many coins and I am so excited. So I actually thought today what we might do is try to fill out some of these market orders because I'm very curious about them. I'm curious about how long they're around. I'm curious about how many you get. And if we fill this one out, then we get a whole bunch of hens and roost rows and tabby plorts and a rock plort. And the hens and the roost rows actually sounded really useful for being able to feed our tabby slimes as well as putting into our coop because that would be very good for our little chicken and coop that we have over here. Oh, they're so cute. I think I have definitely been harvesting them up a little bit too quickly. Do I have, are you an elder? No, you're not an elder yet. I've definitely been harvesting up very rapidly because of our beautiful tabby slimes we have over here who are just so cute. Oh, and they're so hungry. They're so hungry. I want to feed them. And they really need meat and they need meat from chickens. So let's go ahead. I'm going to release these pink slimes. Let's see. How far, how far can these guys safely jump? I wonder. You guys okay? Yeah, they're all right. All right, you can toss them all the way from over there. So let's go around gathering up as many carrots as we can. Gathered up that little pink slime. There we go. Carrots, and then I need to get the fruit over here before the slimes do. Because we need to turn in the pogo fruits and the carrots for some of that market money. Let's see. Did you? Did you, somebody just eat that plort I was about to pick up? Rude much. They're so cute, though. They're so cute. No, I need those carrots. Back off, little ones. They're my carrots now. Oh gosh, did I get them in time? Almost. <laughs> There's so many, so many slimes. Oh my gosh. No, I want that carrot. Oh, that's not a carrot after all. All right, let's see if we can find some more carrots. Let's see. And I need more of the fruit. Can I reach that fruit? Oh, I can. All right, so we have more pogo fruit. So pogo fruit and carrots are our goal. Um, there's cute little babies. Oh, and there's some ports everywhere. Might as well gather up the plorts while I'm here. All right, come here, plort. Where'd you go? I got a little slime. There's a plort. All right, let's run this way. I see a bunch of carrots. So we just need to keep gathering up carrots. And apparently there's a bunch of other, um, other types of vegetables that you can actually find. I right, need this fruit before they get it. All right, hey, back off, little guys. Back off. All right, phosphor plorts. I've got one phosphor plort. Um, I could kind of leave the phosphor plort here, to be honest. But let's go find some more carrots and some more pogo fruit really quickly. Ooh, look at all the stuff down there. Oh, gosh. All right, quickly, quickly, quickly. All right, did I get some? All right, I think I got some. Back off, you guys. I don't want to accidentally suck you up. Largos, get out of here. All right, there we go. There's a bunch of carrots. That should help me out. Here's another pink plort. Oh, I just can't help it. It's like picking up pennies. You just can't help it because you're so excited. You're like, this could be money. All right, let's run up here. Look at all these. Look at all this pogo fruit. It's just laying around on the ground over here. Oh, gosh. All right, let's gather these up. That should be plenty of pogo fruit for what we need. And there's little tabby slimes here. I wish I could get the tabby slimes. Oh, gosh. All right, let's see. I don't think I'll be able to right now, though. All right, there's more pogo fruit. Whoops. Hey, buddies. No, no, they're still in my pogo fruit. They're still in my pogo fruit. There we go. I think that's enough pogo fruit. You can pull a lot down from this tree. It grows quite a bit. That's pretty awesome. All right, there's some chickens over there. Oh, look at all the plorts everywhere. Holy moly. I could be I could be mildly rich with this many plorts. All right, let's see. Come over here. I say mildly rich because they're only worth a teensy bit. All right, look at that. I knew having that upgrade would definitely help us out. And we have a lot of carrots. I'm not sure if that's enough carrots. But I think that's all the carrots we're going to get from here. Oh, dang it. I'm full up on pink plorts. All right. Well, we have to run for it. Oh, look at him play with his food before he eats it. Isn't that the cutest thing? He's just like, I think I might eat this. It's pretty yummy looking. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I love this. I love this. They're all just so adorable. All right. So let's run back home. Let's see if we have enough carrots to be able to finish that. <gasps> Buddy! Are you okay? Can I get him? Can I pull him back up? Come on, buddy. Come on. Oh, there we go. I think we saved his life because if they fall into the sea, I'm pretty sure they die. Oh, and we haven't explored down here yet. Ooh. Ooh. I kind of want to do this next. No, my port. 
<laughs> I went to point and then I like lost my plort. Well, we'll come back and we'll explore over there in just a little bit. All right, well, I guess I can pick up more stuff if I need to. Like you, you can come with me now. All right, let's see. Anything else? No carrots just yet. Any more carrots down here? It's so fun collecting the wild carrots and things like that. All right, let's run back home. And let us put the chikadu away. There we go, tons of carrots over here. Do I have enough carrots? I have enough carrots, I have enough everything. All right, let's put the chicken away. Hello everybody, look at all the stuff you've been gathering up, huh? All right, in this goes. Looks like I have some elders that I need to feed to my tabby cats pretty soon. But let's go ahead and what do you get if I do this? A whole bunch of things. I'm not sure how you get those things though, so I'm a little nervous about this. All right, let's keep going. All right, there's the there's the carrots and here's the pogo fruit. So now what happens? Oh my gosh, it just jumps like dumps everything onto the ground like this. Holy moly days. Okay. Um fort um oh gosh, chickens. Okay, I'll come back for the chickens. Oh my goodness. All right, let's move it. Got to throw these plorts in here. I need to pick up the rest of the plorts. I need to pick up those chickens. I'm stuck with a bunch of pogo fruit and I don't even know what I'm gonna do with it. Oh, I wonder if we could afford enough to get the, the mossy blanket expansion today. Oh gosh, that would be very exciting. All right, let's gather these guys up. Come here, stony hens. Oh, that's so cool. So you just get like an exchange like that and it just dumps everybody out like into your yard. Oh my gosh. All right, well, in you guys go. Stony hens, and I need to gather up the elder hens. Um, how many elder hens do we have? There's another elder hen. And then I think I'm just gonna have to feed like the roost rows to my tabby cats maybe? All right, sorry elder hens. This is just the way of things. Oh gosh, tabby cat got loose, or tabby, tabbies are getting loose. Tabby slimes, I keep calling them cats. Tabby slimes keep getting loose. All right, let's come get this. There we go. All right, and it was their favorite thing, so we got more plorts than usual, pretty sure. All right, maybe not because they're like old. All right, oh, prices are up, huh? Oh gosh, they've fallen so low on the rocks and everything else. Well, darn, I might just wait on collecting those until we've got a little bit more. We need to go look for more because I want to find where the golden slime is. That just seems like it would be so cool to have. All right, let's go ahead and what I'm gonna do, I'm actually gonna remove, let's see, this rooster because he's old and maybe one of the chickens let's see we have two four six eight ten twelve they, they get unhappy if there's too many chickens so i'm going to remove some of the stony hens maybe four or five of them because they are breeding very well so i'll remove six of the stony hens and leave the rest to breed and then let's see all right for my hungry little my hungry little tabbies there's a whole bunch of chickens in there for you guys now all right, let's run over, gather up the roosters. And I'm gonna gather up three of the roosters and just put them in with the tabby cats. Oh dear. There we go, so we're gonna have plenty of plorts coming over there. And then, let's come over, come here, buddy. All right, there's that. I need to gather these up, because I'm gonna feed these to my little luminous slimes, because that'll make them happy. Look how many there are. I'm glad that they're staying in there, too. All right, and so these guys need fed and we're gonna give them the Q berries to eat because that is their natural food That is one of the um, Phosphor slimes favorite foods is the Q berries. So we're giving that to them and then mr. Roostro you can come be in here, too And that should make everybody happy. There's a lot of roosters though, so I'm gonna take one out. There we go So our rooster row management hen management and a lot of tabbies <laughs> a lot of tabby ports in here now All right Oops, and a tabby has gotten out, apparently. My tabby slimes are trying to escape on me. All right, come here, little one. In fact, you know what? We've had the tabby slimes for long enough now. I'm pretty sure they've earned themselves a high wall. And a little music box. Oh, I forget about the music box. The solar shield we don't really need. The collector is nice. Let's go ahead. We're going to get some high walls for these guys. Because I don't want to lose my little tabby cat collection. I really like them. I just keep saying cat. You guys know what I mean. They're based off of tabby cats. So they're adorable. All right, there we go, some more ports in there. And you know what? Let's go do a little bit of exploring. Oh, what's this? One tabby port, one phosphor port, one rock port. Really, what does it give you? Heartbeats! Heartbeats are the favorite food of the um, 
heartbeats are the favorite food of our rock slimes. So that would be kind of interesting. We don't have any heartbeats to garden with just yet. And really, I could start collecting more slimes. So, hmm. Well, I have the phosphor and the rock slimes. Is there a new tabby plort? You know what? Let's do it. Let's go ahead. We're going to put down... I need to make a little bit of room. Let's see. These guys will eat fruit and veggies, so I'll just toss a, billion, a zillion of these in there. There we go. Because they'll eat, they'll eat both. They'll eat all fruits and all veggies. And then I just need one of these. And one of these. And then you come over here. And let's go ahead and activate it. So we just need one of each. All right. And who's it for, actually? Mo Mochi Miles. I need these plorts post haste, whatever the means. All right. So let's go ahead and give them to her. Because I guess she's working on a recipe of some kind. And huzzah! Look at that! Hasty exchange! So we just managed to pull this off. And now here's our little heartbeats. And there we go. Our roost rows. And our stony hens. Wow! We've gotten so many! Alright, I can probably toss a couple stony hens in here. And then I don't really need the rest of them for now. So they can all go in here. Future food for my tabby cats. <laughs> oh dear. And then the heartbeats. I actually want to get those... I'm gonna actually change out the carrots for heartbeats in here, I think. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and change out the carrots for the heartbeats because I haven't found any heartbeats just yet. And I think that they are the favorite food of the rock slimes. So let's go ahead and we're going to remove the crops and it doesn't cost that much to do it, thank goodness. And then we're gonna put in the heartbeats. There we go. And I kinda am tempted to do some more things in here, but I really wanna expand over to the overgrowth pretty soon so I'm just gonna wait on that all right these guys are super happy and I can throw in some heartbeats for them at least because I'm working on growing the heartbeats I'm just gonna throw in these carrots I have so many carrots I wish I could sell the spare carrots but that's not how it works in fact let's go ahead let's empty all of these ports even though they're not at a very good price right now and let's go ahead and buy the overgrowth because I want to see what the overgrowth will do for us oh my gosh I had I have some escapees. All right, I have to get him back in. It's not too hard to get these guys back in when they escape, though. You just have to kind of grab them and push them back in. And cross your fingers that you won't get pricked to death when you go in there with your, your slimes. All right, look at how many plorts we're getting from them. I think they're pretty happy because I tossed in some of their favorite food. All right, they've got lots of favorite food, actually. So they've got tons and tons of food in there. That should last them for quite a while. Let's go ahead, even though they're at low, low prices right now, we're going to sell our ports. And there we go. It's really fun doing the exchange, too. I didn't expect the exchange to be that awesome. Oh, there we are. That's all we need. That's all we need to go to the expansion. We're spending our money so, so quick. All right. The exchange, ra range exchange is offline for now. But let's do this, you guys. All right. We're coming over, and we are going to get this ranch expansion overgrowth. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. There we go! Alright, so what's over here? It's a ranch expansion, huh? <gasps> you guys! You guys! You guys, it's so pretty! Let's move our tabbies over here! Oh my gosh, there's plenty of room for them! There's so much food! Oh my goodness! And there's so many chickens just everywhere! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness gracious. Can I jump up here? I can. I can jump up here and look around. Oh my gosh. There's just so many chickens. So the chickens naturally spawn here. Some of the pogo fruit spawns here. Oh my gosh. Can I jump over that? Probably not. Oh my goodness. And there's carrots around here too. Oh, it's perfect. It's perfect. And there's sunbeams. So we could put the tabby slimes over here and they would just have constant food. <gasps> It's beautiful! We need to go and explore and find some more slimes that we could add over into the overgrowth because this is so pretty. So, 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 so pretty. Alright, so I'm really, I'm really proud of those guys because they're expanding quite nicely. And that also means we could probably have more of the fruits and veggies going around here too. I kind of want to do a teensy bit more exploring too. So let's go do a tiny bit more exploring. We're going to run over here. Nothing to really collect just yet. But we're going to go see if we can see where that giant slime is from. Alright, there's a whole bunch of slimes popping up. There's going to be ports everywhere. I think it's time for us to start exploring and hopefully finding some new types of slime. So there's that port I dropped. Ooh, can I make this? I hope I can make this. I hope I can make this. 
Oh, that didn't do any damage at all. Oh, thank goodness. All right, so to get back, it's like this little path. Okay, all right, we found it. Look at this. Oh my gosh, look how pretty it is. Oh gosh, all right, so let's come over here. Let's see what's going on. That phosphor slime I threw is still here, so we can collect that. It's a big giant slime, and he's just very happily, like, chilling right here on this island. Hi, buddy. Do you just, do you just eat, like, everything? Do you just accept everything? And then, do I need to feed him more? <gasps> oh, look at the cute little mushrooms! Oh, for just a second, I was so excited that the idea that maybe the mushrooms could be used too. Is he just, like, an endless slime that you just constantly feed? Is that what he does? Do I need to feed you more? Hey, you. I don't mind feeding him all that. Oh, did he get bigger? I can't tell if he got bigger. I don't think he got bigger. What happens if he's in a phosphor fort? Nope, can't do that. Nope. So he won't change into another type. Come back here. Where are you going, little fort? All right, he won't change into another type, but you can feed him quite a bit. All right, interesting. Can I jump up here? It almost looks like you're supposed to climb up here, but I'm not sure if that's true or not. Oh, this is pretty. All right, so I don't know what up, what's up with him, other than that you can feed him tons of things endlessly. So maybe he's just a giant hungry slime with an endless appetite, but he's really adorable, whatever he is. So let's see if we can wiggle our way back home from here safely. No! <gasps> he died. Oh, look, there's kelp down there too. What is that? What's that? Do you see that? Oh no, my phosphor slime! I need to stop pointing. I need to stop pointing. It just make, like messes things up. But I think there's puddle slimes or things like that. I think I remember seeing something about puddle slimes somewhere. Hello, buddy. All right, look at all this. Plorts, plorts for the taking. So many plorts for the taking. But we need to do a little bit more exploring. So I'm trying to think. Oh yeah, there's that one area we haven't gone into just yet. All right, well, let's gather up some plorts and pieces like that. And then I think what we might do, maybe we should make some tabby, tabby slime mixes that we haven't had yet. Hmm, that could potentially be a lot of fun. So I think we need to go and look for some more tabby slimes, but think about mixing them with other species that we haven't yet. Hmm, hmm. What kind of species? Which, like, which species of slime? I think we need to go and explore some more. That's basically the bottom line. Explore some more. Let's go up here. And then once we do a little bit more exploring, hopefully we will find some more slimes that we can mix in. There's more tabby slimes. All right, this is where it gets messy. Everybody's eating, oh gosh. Oh goodness, here it goes. Here it goes, it starts getting pretty chaotic in here pretty soon. Oh, goodness. All right, just gonna randomly pick up slimes, I guess. All right, here we go. Let's gather these up. All right, good, 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 good. Right, can I get anything over here? Oh, nope, wasn't able to get over here in time. <gasps> Look at that! It's a rock tabby Largo. I wonder if that's what we would wanna make, rock tabbies. They're really freaking cute. Oh gosh, oh my goodness. Oh, they're so cute. Look at the rock tabbies. Oh my goodness, yeah, I think what we need to do is go back with what we've got. Get rid of this pink slime really quickly. Go back with what we've got and go and see, uh-oh, the tars have begun. Time to get out of here. Oh goodness, ouch, rock slimes. Walking into the rock slimes, painful. All right, we're gonna get out of here before the, the tars start eating us and things like that. And we're gonna try to get enough money that we can get some of the jump boost and things. And then once we grab that, we will start exploring some of the new areas. So that's the plan. That's the plan, get a little bit more money, get some upgrades, and then start doing some big exploring. So I'll see you guys next time, Bye bye